let's update the map. Grom doesn't need a map. I feel like we're going in circles. Excuse me, but I'm looking for some adventurers willing to go on a well-paid mission in this dungeon. When someone says well-paid, we listen. Huh, funny how you're all ears whenever there's a prospect of gold in the air. Go off and die. Uh, sorry, you were saying? The thing is, <clears throat> this quest is not exactly legal. Legality is a rather abstract concept to nobles like me. Right, right. Mm. Let's say I want to borrow something. Borrowing's not stealing, right? Indeed, private property as a concept is not always relevant. Anyways, what did you want to borrow, and from whom? Well, first you must know I'm a cook for a famous tavern in Glarg. You didn't ask for your life story. Cut to the point. My clients have been badgering me, asking me to cook some bear and ale stew, but I can't even get close to the flavor of the one they cook here. <laughs> Roast some bear with some ale sauce on it and boom. That's what I thought. But it also involves some rare spices. The cook won't give or sell the recipe to me, in spite of my requests. So... So we kill the cook and splatter his insides? No, no, I was thinking someone could copy the recipe. Discreetly. I will reward you handsomely. Well, I guess we could borrow this for you. Good, good. I'll be waiting here with your gold. Now, what's this crowd for? Huh, seems like some guy is just lying on the ground. If this peasant is hurt, 
Euclid compels us to assist him. I'll supervise you from some distance. No need for me to taint my hands with his plebeian epidermis. Oh, gods, my career is fucked. Come on now, lad. Maybe you can change your path and become a second-class chamber pot service engineer or temp bidet washer. You mind telling us what happened? It's horrible. I was carrying the inn's revenue to the co-op vaults when some group of thieves ambushed me. That's horrible. Those guys stop at nothing. It's the third time this happened. This time they'll beat me up with a nailed plank. Oh, gods, oh, gods. Third strike. Your number is up all right. See, but maybe the guards could help you out somehow? Whoa, uh, we're understaffed right now, and we have some issues with our RADA. And it's out of my jurisdiction. What? We're talking about bandits hiding inside the dungeon, aren't we? Yes, but the inn's guards can't intervene outside this building unless we catch offenders red-handed or by a judiciary requisition from the co-op. And if we warn the co-op, I'll be executed for not sacrificing myself to defend the gold. Holy cow, that's a hairy situation. We're more suited to field work. Adventurers? The best. So you'll get the gold back? Well, us? Uh, I mean, gold and battle. It's honorable and it rocks. Help me out and I will reward you handsomely. They can't have run very far. Stealing back what was stolen would be a highly ethical and a lucrative endeavor. Uh, we'll think about it. Another house inspection de merde. I already tell you, the meat is not rotten, it's gamey. This is different. You seem like a great cook. What's your specialty? Why, do you like chopped liver? <laughs> My specialty is soup aux trente légumes. But this place is filled with savage. They only think about bear stew. Are you, par chance, amateur of cuisine? Okla, yum yum, tibon. Oh, bear stew rocks. This on the surface, a simple dish, but everyone has a little secret. My secret recipe is renowned throughout the land of Fang. Yeah, well, Krog has the secret of steel. And I have no secrets. Because you're too dumb to remember one. <laughs> <laughs> you talking mop. <laughs> Wait, what's that supposed to mean? Well, then, let's hope you never lose your memory. I've given some thought to that, you know. What with all the magic stuff going on around here, so I've eaten a copy of the recipe. You better not forget your hiding place. No chance. It's where food makes its last stop. <laughs> anyway, back to work. Not now, you leave. You should always note your escape routes on a map.
Ten for you, ten more for me. Wait a second. It's the third time you get your ten, and we didn't. <coughs> it's uh, arithmetic. Yeah, right. Don't you go thinking you can money fucker us or pull the fool over our eyes. Arithmetic is when your fingers hurt. What? No, uh, that's arthritis. Yeah, well, a lolling stone gathers no dough. Don't try and hoodwink us with your flowery words. Beg your pardon, we're looking for the inn's earnings? No way, it's enough of a clusterfuck already. We can't even count. Yeah, even our boss has been duplicitous towards ourselves. Don't listen to them. They, um, hey, wait, who the hell are you? I am a noblewoman, and these folk are my escort. Surrender, at once! To me, my faithful who steal from the rich to give to me, go down fighting on my behalf! Uh, to give to us, you mean? Uh, I knew he was trying to double gross us. Later, later, charge! <laughs> You're gonna die! Close ranks! Uh, damn it, I hate trolls! This is gonna hurt. It's my turn. My turn, Roach. Say hello to my little friend. Oh!
Now, see me? How you doubt? Golf, golf. <laughs> Don't stand so close to me. Take care. Yes. Keep going, then you can eat them. Sorry, mates, but you're about to die.
you. We're done with bandits. And here's the gold. <laughs> a tidy sum, this in revenue. If you needed proof that the people of the land of Fong are drunkards. Now we take it back to the rightful owner. Or we don't and keep it to ourselves. You've got good advice sometimes, my friend. But that's wrong. How is it wrong to keep gold we took from a bunch of crooks who are the leading cause of cirrhosis in the area? Only a select few are truly fit for handling gold, be it from their birth or their deeds. I think we should give it back. It's more heroic. It'll probably get us some bonus XP. You again? What's your poison? We want to see Mel. He's away. Don't know where he is. This place is crazy busy at this hour, and I'm overwhelmed. When was the last time you saw him? Just after Black Smog screwed up the whole dungeon, he ran from his room like the devil was after him, a bottle in hand. Did you notice what bottle he was holding? A Chateau Le Luzer, mayhaps? Yeah, right. I've got nothing better to do. I work here, you know. Someone has to put up with all those drunks who burp their life stories down your cleavage. If you're not ordering, then buy. Fine. We'll go look somewhere else. We could look around his room for hints. Good idea. It's an okay idea at best. Don't blow it out of proportion. Speaking of, how long are we going to have to listen to the thief? My ears are stinging. I was not listening. Me neither. What's he saying? You guys know I read it. They won't go back. He says he doesn't care, and his ears are plugged up with wax. Well, I'll get used to this. At least three of you are sort of listening. Anyway, let's find Mel's room. So, you found the gold? Yeah, we took it from the robber's dead hands. Here. Terrific. This is great. My career is saved. Wait a minute, pal. They gave me the gold. I'll have to file a report to the co-op for this incident. Uh, but, but if you do, I'll be executed. The law is the law, and I'll even get a share of the bonus for getting the gold back. Neat, huh? Uh, holy crap, these people are true troll scum. Excuse me. Nothing. We were just wondering about our own share of the bonus. Whoa. First, this will have to be validated by the Cooperative Repartition Committee, then arbitrated by the Consulting Arbitrative Committee, approved by the Executive Validation Group. Fuck oh, me. Give or take a dozen business weeks. Ha! We should have kept it. It didn't even say the courier. Ari sacra famis, as they say. No time to pontificate. Let's leave. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Damn, what a glory hole. Hey, what? Look, those strange garments. It's a cultist gown. Hmm, smells like wine. And this gown belongs to Tough Luck's clergy. It seems this innkeeper has been hiding a lot from us. I like playing hide and seek, especially in the woods. Maybe he's hiding. We should count before going after him. Yeah, you stay here and count to a million. We'll get a head start. Oh, right. You should go first on account of your tiny legs. Nice burn. Cool it, cockroach. We listened to you once before. Don't go thinking you get to talk now. Look, a wine crate. Chateau Le Luzer. The same wine of which we found a broken bottle in Ravax's apartment. Good gravy. All this fuss over some wine. Beer all the way. Look, I appreciate all these harebrained ideas, but they don't tell us where Ravax is. It's elementary, my dear Ranger. Mel Boots must be involved in Ravax's disappearance. But he's not at the tavern. And since it's impossible to exit the dungeon, he must still be in there. Seems logical, but where? Let's see. Where could an innkeeper, obsessed with fine wine and who leads a double secret life as a cultist, find a hideout? Someplace cool and damp? In the woods? He's in the woods, right? The undergrowth is cool and damp. Nonsense. I got it. He's in a mushroom farm. Inside a meat locker. No, no, you are absolute morons in the basement with all the wine. Mel Boots is in the basement. Oh, yeah, good idea.
All right, come down. We get it. Who's this Mel guy? Oh, God. Let's go to the basement. I feel like we're going in circles. There he is, that double-crossing innkeeper. So, you brainless fuckwits, looking for a good shanking? So you're really evil? I don't think I found you friendly. Ha! Only because I told you you look like a leader. Leader my ass, I've never seen such a punchable face. Any other yokel would be more believable. You're telling me? It's another one of his tricks. But you'll never bamboozle us again with your lies. There's no bamboozling left to do, you fop doodle. I've been leading you around by the nose since the beginning, keeping you off my turf. But now you've really pissed me off. Why is he so mean? He's a cultist of tough luck. Ugh. Keep up a little. Now, nah, it was true I used to be an adventurer. Took an arrow to the knee, got gangrene and all. But then tough luck came to me and saved me. After that, we were pretty tight, you know. Well, you're gonna hand over that bastard Ravax, or we'll take care of both your knees this time. Who's that Ravax guy? Seriously, your friend is a little dim, right? Forget it. So, will you give us Ravax? If you don't, we'll kick your snout in. Too late, buddies. I've hired the best mercenaries there are to turn you into bedside rugs. I'll teleport him to the third floor, right behind Losax's seals. As if. Teleportation is a high-level spell, not some cantrip within any old innkeeper's reach. I've got it all written down on a cursed scroll. Once he's stashed behind those seals, you'll never be able to reach him. Well, see ya, losers! Schlagerbuch. <laughs>
Goff, goff, say hello <laughs> to my little friend. Ow! I'll shatter your spleen! Go. I teleported Ravax away, and now to kick your tonsils up your eyeballs. Take care. Yes. My turn. You'll suffer, topsiders. Wanna take a walk on the vile side? Why didn't I stay upstairs? Don't stand so close to me. Kaldula Opog! This is gonna hurt. First blood.
You orc piss gurglers! That hurt. Just a flesh wound. Some more. My turn now! Tough it out! <laughs> Must pee. <laughs> Not 
really helping the reputation of your class. Shitty, shitty, shit. Here I am. This is bad. That could be me in a few years. Cowardly, but efficient. I was uh, thirsty. Uh, food. Voila! Oh, magic sucks.
The priestess leveled up. The wizardess leveled up. That's it. This asshole's gonna die. Yep, you're not wrong. But it's too late. Life's a bitch. Alright, we can still look for clues nearby. So let's update the map. The elf leveled up. You should always note your escape routes on a map. The barbarian leveled up. Well, it tastes bad. Reminds me of my granny's soup. Hands off my gold, my precious. Gold! <laughs> I'd rather have a nice gallon of ale. Crap, what a mess. did look weird. If it stinks, it's my boots. Careful with my books! Ugh. Reminds me of potions class and that awful teacher with the greasy hair. was not brewed at Milfido's, that's for sure. About a hug. Yippee! I'm getting better. Better than nothing is still not much. Yeah, I'm strong. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> 
I am stronger. Well, new skills. I'm getting better and better. My power grows. Euclid, be my witness. Another jewel to my crown.